guys, welcome to my show. This is Cook It Your Damn Self. My name is David. This is another D Crew production. Today we're going to be showing you uh, how to do some brisket. We're going to do some beans. It's a Super Bowl tomorrow, Saturday night. We're just going to get everything together. It's a kind of a quick episode today. Uh, normally I have like all this stuff going on, but I'm at Marcus's, not in my kitchen. And uh, so why don't we go ahead and get started. So we've got our brisket here, and the good people at HEB was uh, kind enough to cut this for me. So it doesn't ever hurt to ask somebody because they have these huge ones and they cut it in half for me. We only have like about six or seven people coming in uh, for the game. And we've got some beans now. Real quick, the beans, all we did was we have about a pound in here. And uh, all we did was kind of sort them, get the bad ones out, whatever, dirt, rocks, whatnot. And we're going to get that started. But let's go ahead and get this meat going. So I know I'm over here bothering Marcus. Marcus has that studying to do. And we're just going to... Got some rib rub from uh, HEB. We're just gonna coat that. I don't want to put too much, but just enough so that it's got coat coats all the way around. And um, hopefully we'll get a good game tomorrow. I'm not a Saints fan or a Colts fan, although I do have a blue and white jersey on. This is the Cowboys uh, jersey, by the way. So I don't want anybody to watch my show and then get upset. But uh, hopefully it's a close game. We'll be thoroughly entertained. And I just want to get enough of this on there. And uh, we're going to get our pan. We're just going to put that fat side down. And um, so let me go ahead and get this out of the way for now. Another thing I like to do for this uh, brisket. Now, we could barbecue this, but it's a little cold outside. And it's going to be a little bit easier just to put it in the oven. And we're going to... First thing in the morning, about 9 o'clock in the morning, um, we're going to preheat our oven to about 200 degrees. And we're just going to slide it in and we're going to let it cook uh, on its own. And then about 5, right before the game, we're going to take it out and the meat should just fall completely off. And I like to just throw some onions in there. So when we're cooking, it's going to have this oniony smell in this whole place. It's going to be smelling like food, just like the uh, title game. Uh, national title game. Uh, we didn't record that, but we did have some really great uh, rib. Uh, well, it was pork, pulled pork tacos, right, Marcus? Pretty good? Uh, he agrees. All right. So, that's pretty much it. This is our meat. Like I said, 200 degrees. Uh, we're going to put it in the oven about 9 o'clock, so we're going to have it in there about 6-7 hours, and we're just going to leave it alone. We don't have to do anything else to it. It should just come together on its own. Now, as for the beans, like I said, we washed them. And we've got a can of chicken stock here, chicken broth. You can use any type, but I like this one. It costs a little more. It really doesn't make that much of a difference in quality. We're just going to soak these beans overnight, and we're going to turn them on a low in the crock pot. And I'm going to put our spice here. We have another little thing here. It's the pinto bean seasoning. And uh, it says to add, like, three tablespoons, but I don't really like to use that much because it... It's really salty and we're going to be adding other things to this to, to give it its flavor but we're going to just put a little bit of this in there probably like about a tablespoon i don't want i don't want it to be too uh, i don't know what the word is but th this stuff can be really strong if you put too much into it and the other thing we're going to be doing is um the first thing in the morning we're going to put some bacon in there just chop it into chunks and we're going to put a jalapeno uh, diced and uh, cilantro and onion and we're going to top it off with water tonight. We're going to let it uh, soak in the beans. And then uh, when we take it out or turn it off about five-ish, those beans should be like really tender. And it's going to have that bacon flavor. And it's going to have that jalapeno kick. It's not going to be hot. A lot of people might be scared to use jalapenos like that. But uh, they're not going to be like spicy hot. But they're going to have that kick to them. So I think that's about it. Uh, like I said, this is a quick episode of Cooking Your Damn Self. So we'll see you tomorrow. Uh, like I said, hopefully we'll have a good game and everybody will just have a good time. And I guess that's the most important part is like, as long as you have fun. So we'll see you tomorrow. Okay, guys?